Dinner's ready. Okay, hi guys. So, before we get started, please don't mind my eyes. They're a little red because of the pollen. For this tutorial, I'm going to be using two palettes. I'm using the Meat Matrimony. Oh, Meat Matrimony. Uh, palette and then I'm also using the Lorac Pro palette now I have primed my eyes already with I forgot to bring it in here the Lorac eye primer just to get started and it came with my Lorac Pro palette so it was just like a little sample thing okay now to get started I'm using this flat um, eyeshadow brush and I'm going to dip into matte Lynn and that's just going to be my base Okay, um, next I'm going to use this domed, this small domed eyeshadow brush, and I'm going to dip into Matte Lopez. It's, I don't know, it's kind of like a clayish color, like a light clay color, and I'm going to work that into my crease. And when I work on my crease, I like to work from light to dark, so I'll be adding, um, gradually I'll add some darker colors just to give it my crease definition. Next I'm going to use that same brush and then I'm going to go into my Lorac Pro Palette and I'm going to use, ooh, it's, it's messy, it's messy you guys, but I'm going to use this taupe color. I'm going to do that and then work that into my crease next. Okay, now I'm going to go into Matte Kumar, which is a, oh it's so gorgeous, it's such a gorgeous red color, and I'm going to put that right into my crease as well, and uh, like, what the heck. Then I'm going to take a blending brush and start to blend that out. Now I'm going to take a smaller blender brush and go right back into that color and then blend it out a little bit more. Oh. Okay, now I'm going to take a small dome brush once again and dip into matte Mouskowitz. Mouskowitz? I don't know, I don't care. It's like a plum color. And I'm going to put that on the outer corner of my eye and drag it a little bit into my crease. Okay, and just like how I dragged the purple out, I'm going to go back in with the Matte Kumar or the the Matte Kumar or the red color, and I'm going to take that into my crease and then bring it out a little bit more, just so I can um, blend that in a little bit better. Okay, now I'm going to go back into my Lorac Pro palette, and I'm going to use the flat angle brush, and I'm going to dip into the light bronze, and I'm going to pack that. Oh my mirror. And I'm going to pack that onto my lip. Okay, then I'm going to blend that into my crease. Okay, then I'm also going to take and go back into that purple color and blend it out a little bit more with the bronze. Okay, now I'm going to go back to my flat angle brush and dip back into that light bronze. If I can open up the palette. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> dip back into that light bronze, then I'm going to use that to highlight my brow bone.
Now I'm going to dip into the, or a black eyeshadow, and I'm going to dot that into that far corner of my eye, and then drag it in just to give it a little bit more definition and depth. Depth. Now I'm going to take my flat angle brush. If you like how this looks like this with the light bronze, you don't have to do this step. I mean, by all means, do you, boo. But I'm going to dip into Garnet, and I'm going to lightly tap that over where I put the light bronze, just to, I guess, give it like a reddish tint, or like tone it down a little bit. I don't know. I just like how it looks. Okay, now before we go any further with the eyes, I'm going to put on some winged liner, and I'm using, anyway, I am using Wet n Wild Mega Liner. Ooh, I didn't realize I held my breath until just now. Put it on a little bit too thick, but that's okay. I don't want to try to go back and fix it, because then it's going to look worse. The eyeliner would really look a mess when I'm trying to do a video. Okay, now before I finish the eyes, I'm going to go put on my foundation and set my highlight so we can finish it up. Okay, so my face is set. I didn't put any concealer on today just because my face is, because today my face is breaking out. Um, a little more and I didn't want to put excess makeup on it but I still put banana powder on the place I want to brighten okay so to finish up the eyes I'm going to go back into my meat matrimony palette and I'm going to take um, a small brush and I'm going to dip into both the red can you even see that both into the red and to the purple And I'm going to drag that under my eyes and into my wing. And I'm focusing majority of it on the outer part of my eye. Or from my, I don't know, from my iris to the outer corner. Okay, now I'm going to recreate this lid color and bring that down to the bottom part of my lid. Okay, now I'm going to line my waterline with this black liner by Maybelline New York, Master Drama by iStudio, Midnight Master. Okay, now I'm going to go put on some lashes and we will finish the look. Domestic dame, shaking or stirred. I'm the ideal woman all men prefer. Happy wife. Happy life. Domestic dame, shaking or stirred. I'm the ideal woman all men prefer.
Okay. Now for lips, I'm going to go with um, Lipstick Queen Cupid's Bow Apollo. Okay, and that is it for this makeup tutorial. If you like what you saw, make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next week. You're all